Mom, Michael's here with the food. Okay, I'll be out in a minute. I'm just finishing something up. Got everything you wanted, and I had him throw in a couple extra goodies. Thanks, man. I really appreciate it. Yeah, no worries. One's yours. So, how's she doing? She says she's fine, but I think it's just the martinis talking. How you holding up? What do you mean? I mean, you just watched your mom get her heart broken in front of the world. You gotta be serious, right? I still can't believe you did that. What's the matter, Maria? The heat getting to you? You son of a bitch! I'll kill you! You really fooled everyone with that whole nice guy act, huh? It's William Taylor for you. I still can't believe it. I can't wrap my head around it. I need to talk to that guy. You're not gonna do anything stupid, are you? Michael, so glad you're here. I can't reach Lexi and I'm desperate for the things on this list by tomorrow. Mom, you just brought dinner. Oh, thank you, Michael. Anyway, if I'm gonna spin this fiasco my way, I really need all those things by morning. Michael, you don't, you don't have to do that. Mom, would you stop it? You can't be this way. Be what way? You don't mind, do you? I'd go by myself, but the press is out there ready to crucify me. I'm exhausted. No, you know, I'll take care of it. It's not a problem, really. There you see, it's all settled. I'll tell you what, I'll bring this stuff by tomorrow. You. Remember what I said? What's that? Don't do anything stupid. Me for, I'm done with it. No, no, you're not. The numbers are all wrong, Lance. You screwed up. Lance, I was just telling Mr. Aaron here about the delay. Car trouble. You'll be happy to know that we just lost Mr. Aaron as a client. Do we have a problem here? Yeah, I realize it's not ideal. <laughs> We're a long way from ideal, my little friend. I do not have time for incompetence. Hey! I am not incompetent. It has been one mistake after another for months now. I don't even know how you stay in business. <coughs> you don't have the money to pay the lease. On the office? On the office and some other things. <coughs> you see, Lance, it really isn't a choice. Yes. Well, you deserve it. Oh, look. 
who's nervous. More anxious than anything. <laughs> no, stop. Stop. No surprises at the wedding, okay? You know you can trust me. I would never do anything to hurt you. William Chandler, do you take Maria Gianni to be your lawfully wedded wife? No. I do not. I wouldn't marry this heartless bitch if she was the last woman on earth. If it isn't the woman who put the horror back in horrible. <laughs> <laughs>